Falling in love and finding someone to love is like finding God. It just makes you feel good all over. So today is the day. We've been waiting for this day for some time now. And not only am I honored to be here with you today, but I'm also honored to be in love with you. I remember when I first laid eyes on you. Your aura was magnetizing, so magnetizing. Throughout time, our love for one another has grown. We have had our ups and downs, but our downs have made us stronger as one. Today is a special day for us, and there are a few things I would like to thank you for. I would like to thank you for saying yes. I would like to thank you for loving me and allowing me to love you. I would like to thank you for allowing us to spend the rest of our lives together. I would like to thank you for giving birth to our beautiful daughter. I would like to thank you for being a great mother. I do not have words to describe the sparkle I see in our daughter's eyes when she sees you. I say all of this to say thank you for being here and I cannot wait to wallow in our love for the rest of our lives. Dear Alan, I have been looking forward to writing you this letter as I want the opportunity to pour out my heart, mind, and soul to you. I want you to know why I love you and why I am overjoyed to spend the rest of my days with you. You are my true best friend, my protector, my comforter, my supporter, my teddy bear. I love that from the very beginning you have not been afraid to display your love and devotion to me. I love, that you are nat I love that you naturally make me feel so protected and always make sure I am good. I love that you make me laugh, sometimes in the silliest of ways, and lift my spirit at times. The time has come for both of us to take the vow. I believe we both have, have known we, we do from the start. I love you more than I could express in this letter, and I can't wait to build my favor with you. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here together in the sight of God to join together this man and woman in holy matrimony. It is an honorable estate instituted of God, signifying unto us the mystical union that is between Christ and his church. Love does not traffic in shame and disrespect nor selfishly seek its own honor. Love is not easily irritated or quick to take offense. Love joyfully celebrates honesty and finds no delight in doing what is wrong. Love is a safe place of shelter where it never stops believing the best for others. Love never takes failure as defeat for it never gives up. Love never stops loving. God's word continues to be a lamp unto your feet and a light unto your pathway. I, Alan, take V. Lindsay to be my wedded wife. It's having to hold. I'm going to stay forward. For better, for worse. For richer, poor, in sickness, and in health. To love. And to cherish. And to cherish. Till death. Till death. Do us part. Do us part. According to God's. According to God's. Holy ordinance. Holy ordinance. Amen. Amen. All right, Lindsay and Allen, big ups to you. You can take a breath now because the planning is through. When things get tough and push comes to shove, always remember your foundation is love. You're the perfect pair, the perfect fit. So when the words of MC Hammer, you're too legit to quit. I love y'all. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
to tell you the truth, I've been waiting for this moment since the first time I met you. We love you, Lindsay. Alain, Mark, Neva, Juozo. I have a word of advice for you. You must be ready at all times to say to Lindsay, my love, you are right and I'm wrong. <laughs> Our family is humble to your desire to honor the commitment. As Lindsay and I asked Alan, do you think that God chose them for each other? And both of them without hesitation said, yes, they feel that way. So that made my heart feel so good. First question she asked me, what would represent a Jerusalem man? I said, whoa, with a chicken in my mouth. First question she asked. I said, whoa, she doesn't waste time. <laughs> so you know what? Same answer I gave you then, I'm gonna give you now. A Jeroso is a hardworking man, loyal man, and a loving man. And my brother Alan, Alan, <laughs> he's all of those above and more. Yeah.